what's up vids here uh, just making a new surface video just to show everyone how to get rid of that annoying black border that uh, pops up around the game the first time you turn on your surface or install a game well at least it happened to me anyway there was a black border around the entire game and it just looked like crap so um, I went online and I figured out how to get rid of that black border and it actually involves installing new graphic drivers and you know updating your your Intel graphic drivers for your Surface Pro 3 now what you want to do is go to Google and you'll type in Intel download center that's what you're gonna type in um, and you'll come up with a link and you'll just click on that link as you can see here Intel download center pops up on Google you click on that link and it will bring you to the Intel Download Center which is going to pop up in seconds there it is now you see the find by category section what you're going to want to choose is graphic drivers for number one number two you're going to select laptop graphic drivers as you can see there and for number three you are going to choose your drivers for me it's going to be those the 4400 edition i believe surface pro 1 like the first one will get the 40 no the 4000 and it all depends you just got to see what uh graphic driver you have for your uh your surface pro now i'm choosing these and once you choose it you'll come up with this menu to uh you know pick your operating system so windows 8 64 bit that's what all the uh surfaces use and then you'll see two versions the, the betas and the latest and what you're gonna want to choose is the latest so you can try the beta I didn't want to try the beta because I know the you know there's there's bugs and whatnot so I want to make sure I got ones that worked I went ahead and choose the latest and you can see this exe file up here that's the one you do not want to use you want to get the zip and extract it yourself so you'll download that zip file and then you'll just extract it into a folder and then you'll want to uh, install it manually now to do that you go to screen resolution you just right click on the desktop and then you go to advanced settings and then you go to properties you'll click that button and it'll bring up your here and you go to drivers now you have like I said you have to update these manually so you click on the update drivers button right here like so and then browse my computer for driver software now you go down here and the uh, choose the let me pick and then you'll see a list of uh, graphic drivers now you want to pick the ones with the correct date which is the second one three or I'm sorry 517 2014 you want to pick those those are the latest drivers and then click next now, I already did it. I'm just going to X out of here, you know, since I already installed these graphic drivers. Or maybe not. It's not going to let me. Um, but uh, that's what you're going to do. You're going to install them, and boom, you'll have your new graphics drivers installed on the computer, and they'll get rid of those annoying black borders. But first, got to do one more thing. You're going to have to reset your, uh, your, your surface, you know, just reboot it so just go up restart it and you'll notice in your menu you'll have two new options here graphic properties and graphic options now you're going to want to choose graphic properties and that will open up a new menu almost like the N Nvidia control panel but it's the Intel version um, you go to display and then you'll have options to change your resolution now what I chose was uh, I believe uh, 1366 or th by 768 for uh, Battlefield Bad Company 2 and you can actually create a new profile just choose it you s save profile and you can have a new profile like for here I use gaming for the profile and I go back to you know my uh, my setting of 1920 which I actually prefer over the default setting um, and then you can save it and then go back and forth to whichever profile you want depending on if you're playing a game or if you're using your sur surface normally so there you go hit yes and now you have your gaming setting here and you can apply hit the apply button 
and uh, you're saved. You could also save the profile. And that's that. As you can see, I'm currently downloading Battlefield 3 for my next test video. So that's a uh, that'll be next in the line of my Surface videos. Will be the Battlefield 3. You can actually see the icon up there. Well, let's pop it on here. Put on Battlefield Bad Company 2, and as you can see, no ugly borders. Everything is working correctly, and you can rock on. All right. Well, if you like the video, please subscribe and hit the like button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down. Tell me I suck. Alright, take it easy man. Thanks for watching.